A new greenway of business at Fort Benning, a landfill at the post, will soon be used to generate plenty of energy for internal operations. News 3's Brandis Hudson covering Fort Benning with details on plans to take waste and make it work for thousands of soldiers. There are literally thousands of landfills that are either just venting methane gas or flaring it. Now, Fort Benning and Flex Energy Incorporated are working to make good use of landfill waste on post. Taking waste gas, methane, and converting it to energy, electricity, and doing so with nearly zero emissions. A ribbon-cutting ceremony for the Flex Power Station was held at the landfill on First Division Road and Harmony Church. The Department of Defense and their installation spends over $4 billion a year in energy. Considering that number, organizers plan for the Waste to Energy project to reduce the Army's carbon footprint. That's helping to deliver both environmental protection, economic development and prosperity, and energy and national security. Power Station has already undergone initial operations tests. A trial run in August produced up to 230 kilowatts of renewable energy. Uh, and that's what we're doing here at Fort Benning, uh, producing enough electricity for about 250 homes with this machine. So it could be referred to as a pollution control device that pays for itself. Once the final set of tests are complete, the system will start generating electricity full time. At Fort Benning, Brandis Hudson, WRBL News 3, on your side. Tests on the Flex Power Station are expected to wrap up within the next two weeks.